Trump end runs the CIA. President Trump granting the Attorney General Bill Barr sweeping new powers. Powers that put the CIA, the FBI, the rest of America's intelligence community under bar when it comes to declassifying intelligence related to the Russia investigation. He's a uh, great gentleman and a highly respected man. So everything that they need is declassified and they'll be able to see how this uh, hoax, how the hoax or witch hunt started and why it started. Uh, it was a, an attempted coup or an attempted takedown of the president of the United States. Well, let's just be clear. Of course, we know why the Russia investigation, which resulted in 34 indictments, started. It's right there in the Mueller report in the introduction. A foreign government contacted the FBI about a May 2016 encounter with Trump campaign foreign policy advisor George Papadopoulos. Papadopoulos had suggested to a representative of that foreign government that the Trump campaign had received indications from the Russian government that it could assist the campaign through the anonymous release of information damaging to Democratic presidential candidate Hillary Clinton. Okay, well, Trump doesn't want to hear those facts. What he does want to hear is that something else happened. So he's going to give sweeping powers uh, to a person who so far has been essentially a yes man to his every whim, a person who seems to agree with the president. What I'm most interested in is getting started, getting started on going back to the origins of exactly where this all started. The first step is find out exactly what happened. They spied on me. They spied on our campaign. I think there was a spying did occur. Yes, I think spying did occur. Well, as Barr himself knows, since he once worked for the CIA, the word spying has negative extra legal connotations and it has a definition. And what happened as Trump's handpicked FBI director, Trump's Handpicked FBI director has explicitly said in public testimony under oath to the American people, what happened was not spying. Well, that's not the term I would use. Not the term he'd use, because legal surveillance of people is not what they call spying. But if the president is really declassifying material and putting everything out there, you know, just because he wants people to know the truth, right? I mean, let's, let's just say maybe that's it then why is he blocking every single congressional subpoena? Why is he appealing them in court, fighting them with every single thing he can to prevent the American people from seeing anything about the Russia investigation that he does not want us to see? Maybe it's because he thinks if he says this enough, people will believe the lie. And just so you know, I was the most transparent and am transparent president in history.